Good evening and welcome back to Timberborn here on Lake Biwa where we have our explosives still being placed over here. We're expanding out to do stuff over here. Um, this district is doing okay kind of here. I need to just explode more things out there but unfortunately I'm actually struggling for explosives. I think I'm using a lot of them. Um, I've got 228 but that isn't actually that many. So I really need to have more storage for them or possibly send out more i mean district 2 doesn't particularly need them because this is going to get blown up and then uh, we're done we're done district 2 will not have to blow up anything more maybe a little bit over here but nothing major district 3 however desperately wants more of them so i might in fact i will build a storage a large warehouse yeah um actually what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put the gap in between so that you're not blocking everything off in so many places um and that is going to become our explosive storage and then we're going to change our explosives limit to be a thousand boom there we go so we're going to ask for a thousand explosives awesome when it comes to this district, however, the, the metal district, which is the next thing we're going to build, um, uh, we're going to go down lower. Um, I basically had uh, two people say I should go down to the level to the, water, the, the level of the water and one person said I should go one block above it. I was kind of going with one block above it because of, um, in case there's any more flooding, I kind of want to go just one block above the water and have it there but i do kind of like the idea of putting them put, putting these platforms directly in the water and having them so that instead of sitting uh like well oh, yeah, about that um the metal platforms would just be directly on top of the water which would mean we could just walk straight off onto here to get some food for things which i kind of like kind of like that idea of it just literally being like hey look the top of the water has just got a metal a metal plate over the top of it so I think that's what we're gonna go with. I think that's what we're gonna go with. so what we need to do then is we need to block these further down Doop. Doop. whoa that's not what I wanted oh um uh, it was it was quite ironic as well because uh um, can't remember who it was. I did reply to the comments, so apologies for uh, not remembering your name. Um, but I uh, mentioned how that my game seems to be running a lot better um, with 500 beavers than uh, theirs was with only 200 beavers. And uh, it, it struggles a lot in places and then seems to pick up and be fine and struggles again in places. What is that? Oh, we've got a labour monument over there. Oh, I forgot we built that. Well, that means this is all complete. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Awesome. Uh, so, I mean, we can add um, our rooftop terraces up here. Which is what I wanted to put up here. So, hmm. I'm going to leave a gap in between them. Uh, Side. Oh, uh, hey, we've got to do that that side anyway, haven't we? Uh, yeah, you know what? You know what we're gonna do? We're going to, um, like that. Um, and then, uh, we're not gonna be light of anything. Uh, we've got some shrines. Shrines, um, let's unlock the shrines. We've got, we've got the, we've got the shrines. Shrines can just be dotted pretty much anywhere, so they're not, they're not like a huge, a huge thing. But they add to work speed. I click on a beaver. Go down here. Spirituality. We've got the temple, which gives plus 25, and the shrine gives plus 5. Um, and shrines are like just a short little, 
Now, I'm going to leave that spare because I want to put the other, the, the flame up there. Uh, that covers everything. So the other tribute, the flame of progress, which we can unlock because we have the research. The flame of progress can see up there. I don't know where the front is to it. So I cannot tell. So if I rotate it round by one, and pick another one. question is does it remember no it's per building isn't it hmm. Hmm. it doesn't matter it does not matter we'll put that there and then we've we'll got got some shrines around for the beavers to do their thing up on top try and try and there we go there we go. they've got some things to build there okay. Uh, this one could do it. There we go. There, there's there's the big lag spike um, that I do get every now and then. Um, I don't know if it shows up very well on the videos because I've got used to it, so it, I just stop for a moment and then carry on. So sometimes you'll notice I'll just stop, not move the mouse or camera anything, let it pick up and carry on. Um, so we'll see. Uh, so if we want to put some shrines in here, I can't really get up on top of these because I've not really designed it in that way, shape, or form. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of that, get rid of that, and we're going to put them all in here. All in here. We don't have any any space for the tributes, unfortunately. Uh, if we get them on top, I suppose it would kind of work, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, we've actually got 27 homeless beavers here right now, but that's because we've got way more beavers than we should actually have. Uh, the, the end product of lots of testing, not by me, by Kaboom and uh, Spiger, who I was pronouncing your name wrong, very sorry, um, uh, is the general consensus is that without the tribute of ingenuity we should be getting about 18 and a half beavers per vat there is a there is a float of you know so much so i'm just i'm just going to go with the 18 and a half beavers per vat we have 10 that should be 185 beavers roughly and we have housing for 224 so 10 vats we should be fine not a problem hopefully maybe we'll turn some more on afterwards and we'll see how it goes but um but that should be fine Right now it's all completely messed up because of uh, migrating beavers around and doing things like that causes just an upset in it because you end up with more beavers at random ages than all just being young and growing through and growing old so it messes the numbers up so. Uh, but if you want to get a tribute in here, I'd like to get it in like there. But we can't get up there, there's no way for us to get up there. I put it in there I can put it in there and they can get to that and that would work actually that would cover all the houses so we'll put it in there and the flame can go next to it because the flame is large enough um, to cover the area but on and then if we want to put the tribute of ingenuity we need to put it up here and this works because I believe no I'm wrong maybe hold on thought we had that all connected to the power grid no no we don't have it connected to the power grid but we can connect it to the power grid this is the beauty of this system what we can do is we can grab a power line we can literally put it in there like that and that will connect this to these houses and the barracks and housing transmits power so the power will then be transmitted through the through there up into the warehouses and the warehouses can then share it so the tribute of ingenuity can go on top here somewhere and we're away we're sorted that would be awesome so that would work pretty well i think um yeah because then all this power is being shared through this side um, and Oh yeah, there's a power cable underneath this stairs here. So these are all being connected, which is why they demand all the power. So yeah, so all their power system is connected all together. Um, everything will be awesome. It will be fantastic. There will be lots of rejoicing. Okay, so let's detonate all these. I wish there was a quick button to detonate them. But then I'd probably blow beavers up by mistake. So 
perhaps not such a good idea. And boom! Okay. And then if we put in, I'm going to pause the game and put that in there. Uh, we're still. Is that two above the water? One above the water? I think two above the water. Yeah, can I please click that? Thank you. No, no. no, that's one above the water because the water's dropped down a little. I need to go down one more for that. Um, to have it all level with that, so. Okay. Okay. We do also need to get down to it, so. We may have to. But we will have to somewhere put in a a smaller just looking at where I've lined this up to. Do I wanna do those there? Or do I wanna go this way? Well I can't fill them in now anyway, so we'll, we'll do that. We might we might take out the edge of the water here so we can still be solid metal. We'll see. We'll see. Um but what we'll do is that at some place um we will put in the three by three. This one here, let's unlock this one here. But no. yeah. the three by three is obviously smaller than those ones. So we need to make sure we don't blow it down as far. But that will give us a gap around it, which we can then put stairs in to get down to the bottom of the water because we'll need to blow more holes out as we go. So we will need that at some point. That is fine, that is fine. Okay, so this has been built now. Excellent. We don't want anything in there. And now we want all the explosives, please. Bump, store all the explosives. And whoop. No, must remember, there is no copy. There is no copy. Not playing Factory Town now. No copy. There we go. Okay. Um, and we've got no homeless beavers. Yeah, we're all good. 54 beavers. 54 faces. This is all good. We've got some unemployed here, I think, haven't we? Yeah, nine unemployed. And the good news is our rear canal is working. It's working very well. And I think we're full on cattail crackers and we're getting there on carrots. I want to add more carrots um, to this here. Uh, so I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, what I'm going to do is change up this. So I don't want you to plant there anymore. Don't want you to plant there. I want to do carrots. I don't know how far. Uh, uh, we'll do it right up to the back. Why not? Bum, 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 bum. And we'll put another farm in there, and that's going to be space for. Uh, actually, no, we'll put another. That's, that was the plan. We'll put another farm in there. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, there. Yep, there we go. That's what I want. That's what I want. Then it's a. A nice symmetrical field. We'll put in a uh, uh, another um, either bakery or something here, which will be doing something else. I don't know what. Um, and another farmhouse there. So we've got two farmhouses doing carrots. Uh, because getting the carrots in is going to be important. Going to be very, very important. Okay, everything seems good. People are not dying of anything other than old age, which is really, really, really good. That's what we want. That's what we want. No death. Only life here. Only life. And our drought's going to be over very soon as well. Which would be even better. Uh, these buildings here lack water. Yeah. You pump out an awful lot of water from this, this system. So... Perhaps I should have made this whole corner a giant reservoir. We could still do that. Um, I just feel like if I do it now, we're going to really struggle for water. Um, between things, we could always blow all this up here. And then... Mm, mm, very... Maybe, maybe, we'll see. We'll see on that one. That's that's a way off yet. Yeah, that's a way off. So okay. He doesn't care. No. Do we not have explosives? You're not you're not doing explosives? 
What's happened? What's happened to the booms? There's supposed to be an earth shattering kaboom. We have 42 of them. The answer to all and everything. And yes, yes, they are the answer to all and everything. I also very, very, very much think I may have to start slowing down um, my game, I'm not running it at three times speed. Uh, so why is no one taking the explosives to go and plant them there? We are not building anything in this area here. That you can get access to. You can definitely get out here and do these. We know you can get out here and do this. It doesn't say they're out of range. You have 42 explosives. These are all within range. Why you know do the... The thing. Why you know the thing. Unless we don't have any explosives. Now, pause. Uh, do we not have any explosives in the warehouse? What's this? This is metal blocks. Oh yes, I should really do that as well. I should store my earth. I, I was waiting to store. Oh, 42. Why are you not? Why are you not placed them? We haven't told you to build anything new. Why have you fallen asleep there? Why? What? What is happening? What? What is happening? What is happening? I haven't. I, t time. Time is fine. Time is fine. I know we've got more beavers than. Than we need. I really wish I could get up on top of here. Maybe can. Hold on. I'm very confused why there are beavers being exhausted. And your. What? Why? Why? Explain. Explain why you are exhausted. Is it because they're having to travel so far? Is this is this a problem? Is this a problem? Because it seems to be the hot I should have checked the other ones, actually. Um But I wonder whether the haulers are having to to like they're doing jobs which are just like taking them really far to do things. These are not getting built for some bizarre reason. Something is broken. Something is broken. I do not know what it is. But something is broken somewhere. Oh! Oh no no. No no, I know what it is. They were they were building these. That's what it is. They were building the Labour Monument and the Flame Progress. That's what they've been doing. Because that's the order of build things. And these take a lot. These take um, uh, 200 wood and then 400 planks. So yeah, they, they, they take a lot of work. And we've only got... Uh, what have we got in this district? Um, we've got eight builders. That's it. We've got four builders and four in the in the town centre. That's it. So, so that makes sense. They were all working on these. Okay, that's fine. Uh, now you should build the underground thing there, which will connect to this grid here. There we go. This soil is now connected with power, which means that the tribute have power. They don't need them, but they've got them. And if we built the tribute ingenuity, then everything would be fantastic. I don't want to do that yet. Don't do that. Yet. Um, we could do. We have the resources for it. We can unlock it. We've got eighty-five thousand research points. We can unlock it easily, but I don't want to do it because it would extend the life of all our beavers. And we we're already struggling. We've got 26 homeless beavers. We've got 92 unemployed beavers. Um, yeah. yeah. We just we need we need we need a bit of a dive coming along. And I, but I need to pay attention to it because if I don't pay attention to it, then um, we have a major dive. and we end up like I did before, where literally District Three. Um, was the only one that had beavers there. I think District 1 had something like about 10 beavers left in it. Um, and District 3 had its beavers. And it was, right, okay, we need to reseed the world. Um, rebuild the population. Not quite Adam and Eve. But, yeah, close enough. Okay, so. Let us build the large metal platforms that we want to build here. I want to put two in, which is going to be a thousand metal. 
and I want to put them in. I should maybe not put them in directly in the centre of this. That's probably not the greatest thing that I've done, but. I'm going to build that one. And that one. Not on the end. No, we'll build, we'll build this one, this one. Oh, yeah, no. Because. Because. Uh -huh. uh, now, uh, the other thing as well is do I want to go. No, I want to build a bridge over to them, don't I? Could literally build a bridge over to them. It's not a bad idea. We'll get them built first. Uh, but what I want to do is I want to put a storage up here and a um, drop-off point. One of these. Um, and go, hey, would you store metal metal blocks here? In in this next issue that's going to be built here. Would you store metal blocks here? We can build all of these from our main beavers here. Um, but we're going to eat through our metal blocks very, very quickly. Um, which actually is kind of fine. Actually, now, now I think about it. Ooh. Let's just let's build the rest of these because might as well. We might as well. It's gonna take a while. It's gonna be a big project. It's gonna be fine. Let's uh, click one of them so I can show you that we're gonna be basically a large metal platform on the surface of the water, which is gonna be awesome. And then we will we might build a couple of bridges to it, like the longest bridges, because we can. Because why the hell not? If I point that one that way, and do one. That is one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we build out a couple of platforms there. And build a platform there. Put the bridge there, like that. Connecting bridge. Yeah. yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. I'm going to tell them that this is the absolute lowest priority. Don't worry about the bridges. They're not important. Um, but that's kind of how we're going to connect it to the mainland. Really, really makes me want to do over here so we can have a nice 5x5 metal platform. It may not even go that far. It may just literally be a 5x5 metal platform. Um, and essentially just be housing. It's going to rely on everyone else sending it goods or whichever district's going to be relying on sending its goods. Yeah, I kind of like the idea of doing that now. Let's, let's do that. Let's do a five by five. We'll blow those up and put enough more in there. Cool, 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 cool. I'm going to set you to be a low priority. You to be the lowest priority so we can do it. Boomies first and other things if we do other things. But yeah, okay. Okay. So I think you're good for food here. Um, I, we, we extended the potatoes a little bit but not majorly um uh, I, I i i it makes sense in my head i don't know if this is actually a proper thing or not I don't know, but it makes sense in my head that when you get a surplus for one type of food it will mean that there's an ease on the other types of food so they all they want to eat all the different foods and they eat them in a certain order um you know they'll go oh i want to eat this one i want to eat that one blah 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 but i think when they're hungry um, if you have a surplus of a, of a food type, it's like, oh, well, they, they don't, they don't like, you know, they're, they're not going to go and eat all the cattail crackers because there's, there's a varied food. Whereas if there weren't carrots, you would put a heavier load on the other food. So having a big surplus of carrots is easing up the other foods. They, they still eat them all. They still want to go and go through and eat all the different, all different food types. They want all different food types. Um, Personally, I would have thought it would start at the top and work down, so I'll check whether I want carrots, then potatoes, then bread, then grilled turd, then blah, 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 blah. But it, it apparently doesn't. It works in a different order than that. Might be alphabetical because of how program works. Not sure. But, yeah. Um, Bruce will perish again a little bit. 
not a great deal. Might do this only four. It's eight rooftop terrace for hundred nitro beavers. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. A building let's work. What? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, and also this is a failure. This is a failure straight off the bat. It was mentioned in the last episode. Somebody saw this farm can reach carrots, so they've been nicking carrots. So they're going to live for longer anyway. But it's okay. So we can do a test with this one of what it would be like with one vat plus the bonus to carrots, because everyone's going to get the bonus to carrots, which is going to be uh, plus thirty percent. So we'll see. So that means. Um, We should get 14. There should be 14 beavers living here. It should balance out too. It's going to take a long time to do. It takes, um, uh, well, it, it's 40 days for their age, plus 30% of 40, which I don't know what that number is, but you add that all together, and then they've got to go through like an entire life cycle before it gets to it anyway. Um, I could I could figure the math out for that one. I don't know. It just, it, 14, I think it should be 14 beavers. 13 beavers. 13 beavers. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I don't know. We'll just see what happens. This is just going to be left for the moment as an experimental little area. And that's it. Um, the scavenger flag doesn't have anyone working in it. We could get the scavenger flag going, but then I don't really want to fill this with... Uh, I don't want to fill this with rep. Uh, interestingly enough, they are picking carrots, but not many of them are ending up in here. I would have thought this would have been full of carrots, because when you're not going... Mind you, you prioritise potato too. Hmm. 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 Because drop that down, so there's two unemployed beavers, at least, or one unemployed beavers. Alright, so now you're going to work, do your thing. Okay, I'm going to say, um, you're full. You're full of gravitators. I do not want you to store scrap metal in here. Please, no scrap metal. Food. Food is important. No scrap metal. Don't need scrap metal. That's fine. We could build another storage for that, but no. you, you can get your 20 scrap and then that's it. You're done. Okay. So, that's where we're going to leave this one. And we will come back next time um, and we'll see how this goes. This is going to take. A long time to build because it's going to eat through all of our blocks or metal blocks uh, and then the idea is going to be that uh, uh we right, you were sending uh, oh you were sending carrots to district three i didn't realize you were still sending carrots to district three sorry satellite oh sorry i thought i thought i disabled that a long time ago so nope sending uh, berries to district five so that's it uh, but when when our great starvation happened it, it was uh, uh it wasn't it wasn't good. what about you what are you sending where you're just sending scrap all the way back to district one that's fine um and then district one i think is going to send uh metal blocks to this district just just so we can fill this district up with metal blocks uh, and we might send like just you know the basic stuff over to keep some beavers alive on here just so they can fill some storages with metal blocks and then when we go hey do you want to build they'll build but if we're going to do a five by five at least to start with we might go over the rest of it block i mean in this corner here i don't know we'll see we'll see but okay so thank you very much for watching i hope you have enjoyed this one i hope to see you again in the next one until then as always have fun <laughs>